All right, so we are back with the destructive diseases of the chest. The destructive diseases involve the presence of more air than normal or destruction or collapse of something. So your two main destructive diseases of the chest are emphysema and pneumothorax. Emphysema is a disease of the lungs that develops over many years, most often from smoking. So your smokers, um, your patient with a history of smoking um, might have emphysema. The alveoli in the lung tissue are destroyed and um, this can't support the bronchial tubes. The tubes end up collapsing and cause an obstruction or a blockage which traps air inside the lungs. The appearance will be an overinflation of the lungs and often the diaphragms look almost flattened or kind of pushed down versus the normal kind of um, arc that we would see. Pneumothorax is the presence of air in the pleural cavity. Air in the lungs is normal. We like that. Air outside the lungs in the pleural space is bad because depending on the size of that pneumothorax, it can actually cause the lung to collapse. So pneumothorax is not the collapse of the lung. It is air in the pleural cavity that can cause the lung to collapse and it will look um, solid black and you won't be able to see the lung markings well. So let's look at two pictures um, that I have here showing you um, the different ones that you might see. The pneumothorax on this chest x-ray is on the left side here. If you look at the two sides, I want you to first think which is the good side and which is the bad side. And a lot of times students or new techs will think that this is the bad side because you see all of these lines. But in actuality, this side, which is a very clear black appearance with no lung markings, is the bad side because there's pneumothorax. So there's air in the pleural space. This is a huge pneumothorax, by the way, it's massive. Um, and the, the lung has been collapsed. So it's way down here. Remember your lung is tissue. So that air pushed on that lung and it's now collapsed in this little space. So this is a pneumothorax on this side. This is normal lung with normal lung markings over here. This one is your emphysema. So you, the lungs are overinflated. They come all the way out to the chest wall. They're going to have very long lungs a lot of the times. And then if you look at the diaphragms, they look almost flat in appearance. Uh, versus this one that has an arc between the angles. Over here, it looks almost flat. So overexpansion, um, a flattened diaphragm is common um, ways to pick up emphysema. And remember, these are going to be your smoker patients. So they have done a lot of inhaling, exhaling because of um, the smoking and it's caused um, the bronchial trees um, to collapse and uh, or the bronchioles to or alveoli to collapse and the air is trapped in the lungs which is causing them to overinflate. so these were your two destructive examples and i hope you join me for abdomen